Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Ashley and today I'm going to be doing a postpartum haul. So as uh, a lot of people know, after you have a baby, your body doesn't go right back to the way you would like it to be. So I went out and I bought some more new jeans that fit and some other clothes. So I just thought I would share with you what I got and what it looks like. So I'm just going to be trying it on here so you guys can see it. So the first thing I got is I got these jeans. They are from Old Navy. They were $55 but they were on sale. I definitely recommend looking for sales in Old Navy in those places because they constantly have them. But uh, I got them in a size 14. So uh, before pregnancy, I was a size 12, so I'm just one size bigger. And real, I'm at my pre-pregnancy weight, but I have a lot more going on in the stomach than I did before. So this is what the jeans look like. I find they hit at a really good point. I thought I would want super high rise. So they look from the side and then from the back. I thought I'd want the super high rise ones, which I did get a pair from American Eagle, which I will be showing you next, but I like the rips and I find these ones a lot more comfortable actually than the American Eagle ones. And these are the rock star at Old Navy. So yeah, I'm going to show you the next one. The next pair of jeans that I got, they are from American Eagle. They are the high rise super skinny and I got these in a size 14 as well. Like I mentioned, I found the uh, Rock Stars more comfortable and I think it's because like I feel really secure in these jeans and they're quite comfortable in the legs, but this band up here, it's still quite tight. So this is what they look like from the side. Like it's quite tight. So if you're sitting for long periods of time or anything, then it's, it's quite uncomfortable because the band doesn't really stretch. So, and this is what they look like from the back. So, and these ones cost $60. The next thing I got is this a plaid shirt, and this is from Old Navy as well. It I got it in a size extra, extra large, but as you can tell, it is quite big. The reason I got it in a bigger size is because, one, I was intending to breastfeed, so I thought my boobs would get bigger so I thought I wanted the space there but also because for nursing it buttons up and down so I thought it'd be really convenient although I'm not breastfeeding now I because I have a video on my channel you can go check that out but um, it's just really it makes me feel good because I can hide in it if that makes sense like from the side you can't really see my stomach or the rolls or the skin that's you know it's not tight and it's just it's comfortable and it's um yeah I think it looks nice and yeah the next thing is this cardigan that I got from Old Navy as well it what I got in size extra extra large and it was $50 um, it is very soft I love the color it's very fall like it's this burnt orange kind of ready color I don't know how it's coming up on camera but uh, yeah I just think it's a really nice layering piece and it's quite big so again I find that you can't really see my stomach in it or anything like that so it makes me feel confident and like I'm kind of more put together than I am so I think that's really what I was looking for is things that make me look more together than I actually am. So as some of you know, I live in Canada, so coats are a staple here. So this one I got from Gap. I got it in a size large. I definitely think they run quite uh, big. So if you're like, because normally I wear an extra large, so unless I want something baggy like the Old Navy pieces, but I got this in a large, which you would think weird for a coat, but yeah. So this is regularly $180. I got a 40% off though, so I would definitely wait for there to be a sale on. This is what it looks like from the sideways, and this is the hood. And I'll open it up to show you inside. So inside, there's this liner. It's kind of sh the sh it's the shiny material. It actually unbuttons. So if you want this as a thinner coat, it can be. So I would not say this is a heavy duty winter coat. Sorry, my baby sneezing. Uh, it's not a heavy duty winter coat, but it definitely is a good fall coat. This is the next coat that I got, and it is actually from Zara. It is only $80, which is a really good price for a coat, 
in my opinion. I probably will only keep either the green one or this one though, just because I do have a lot of coats already. So let me know in the comments below which one you think I should keep because I have no idea. So yes, I really like this one. It's kind of like a pea coat almost, but short, I don't know. Don't quote me on that. But um, it has the fur hood. This is what it looks like from behind. Um, I got this in the size extra large. I did order it online. I tried the large on in store, but it didn't fit. So yes, um, this is the coat. I think it's really cute and I really love it. It's quite thin though. It's not something that will definitely keep you warm in the midst of winter. So um, don't be thinking that. But yes, it is really lovely and I really like it. And um, actually I'll show you what it looks like just undone. So this is how it's just, yeah, cute. The next thing is the shoes. They are from Gap. They are quite cute. They're little loafers and they are leopard print. Um, these were originally $60, I believe. And um, yeah, they're quite cute. Uh, I would recommend trying them on in store and not buying online though, just because I did get the size nine, which is typically my size, but they are quite tight. I did try on the 10, but they were slightly too big. So depending on if you're more a bit bigger of a nine than normal, then you might have to size up. So yeah, they are very cute and I love them a lot.